Hey y'all, hi, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic, lovely day so far. My name is Mandy, thank y'all so, so much for being here. Today's video, we're gonna be talking about and trying on some brand new clothes from Old Navy, which I just gotta tell you, I never thought in a million years that I would be enjoying so much because there was a time period in my life probably from like 2012 till just a couple of months ago where I was just blocking them completely out of my noggin. I was like, Old Navy who? <laughs> who is she? But some of y'all were insistent that I try the brand again and honestly, I am so, so glad that I did because they are a solid clothing brand. I mean, basic, yes. I will give you that, but I mean, the definition of basic is like the fundamental foundation of which all things are built including a solid wardrobe. <laughs> so if all that sounds good to you and you enjoy plus size fashion, but you really don't enjoy overspending, then please consider subscribing because that is what we do here. And as always, I'm gonna include all the links to everything mentioned found in the description box below. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna give y'all the really quick rundown on outfit number one, because I have had my eye on this sucker for literal months. And I'm just gonna give you a forewarning, <laughs> it's ugly. This is going to be the ugliest outfit that I'm probably ever gonna show on my channel. However, this is something that I'm gonna wear probably nonstop until the stitches fall out of it because hello, I don't know if y'all have met me, <laughs> but my true form is Danny DeVito from the Batman movies. Yes, I'm Penguin and this is my outfit. <laughs> Appetite for destruction? Contempt for the czars of fashion. <laughs> so this is the jumpsuit that I've been talking about here on my channel that I have had my eye on for so, so long. And I am so glad that I finally found it in my size. And this is in a gray color. Although when you buy it online, they give you like these weird names for it. I think there was two other colors available, but this one was like, I don't know, Onyx Sunrise or something. It's gray, okay, it's gray. <laughs> But this is the most comfortable jumpsuit that I have ever found in my whole entire life. And I will be buried in the sucker. I will die on this hill. <laughs> but it has the scoop neck design in the front as well as the plunging neckline in the back, which I think is super, super cute, y'all. I mean, my bra is just out loud and proud. <laughs> it just is what it is. But you can totally add like a t-shirt or a sweatshirt on underneath this, especially since it's still really chilly outside. When I got this jumpsuit in the mail, y'all, I, I could not open it fast enough and put it on my body. And I just wanted to run around the house singing like Rod Stewart. <laughs> if you want my body and you think I'm sexy. It even has pockets, which I'm so excited about. And it's just so stinking soft. It has like fleece lining on the inside just for a little bit of added comfort and warmth. But I picked this jumpsuit up in a size 3X and it fits perfectly oversized. I love it so much. And the materials list is made of 55% cotton and 45% polyester. All right, y'all. So now for something a little bit more attractive because the jumpsuit was like, on a whole nother level. <laughs> At least I hope this one is a little bit more attractive. We'll see. I would love to know your opinions, but this is going to be like a mix and match separate piece. And we're gonna start with the jumpsuit first. So this is what the top looks like. This is a really pretty white ribbed jumpsuit. And my favorite, favorite detail about this is that it has the little bows right here at the shoulders that are adjustable. So you can adjust these however you want. If you want a little bit more cleavage or a little bit more modesty, you can certainly like change it up if you want to. But this is a really nice thick material that is so, so comfortable and soft. These have a full panty at the bottom. So you don't have to worry about no thong, 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 thong issues and they also have like the snap button closure which is super convenient. I haven't quite figured out the whole bra situation to wear with this but you know whatever it just is what it is not a big deal but I picked these up in a size 2x and they are made of like a cotton modal mix which is really really soft. But the jeans that I chose to go along with this jumpsuit are really, really cute. So these are the extra high rise, sky high, wide leg, secret smooth pocket jeans. <laughs> Couldn't have been a longer name, I'm just saying. <laughs> but I picked these up 
in a size 20 and this is what they look like. So I would say these are like a cross between a light wash and a medium wash and they do have some distressing. So they have a little bit of distressing right here at the hip and then a little bit around the kneecap. And then whenever you go down to the bottom of the jean, it does have like that raw cut hem. And these are definitely like a relaxed boyfriend style jean. You know what I'm talking about? Where they're like fitted right there at the stomach and then very comfortable down the leg. And I don't know why y'all, <laughs> I don't know why, but this is giving me like 90s Janet Jackson vibes. Anybody else? Like Rhythm Nation, love would never do without you. <laughs> like Antonio Sabato Jr. in that music video just had my hormones doing some cartwheels y'all. Oh my goodness. And as I mentioned before, I picked these up in a size 20 and I will say these fit very, very well. However, I do find from one style to the next with the old navy jeans, they are hugely inconsistently sized. So if you pick up one style in a size 18 and then you pick up another style in a size 18, they might fit completely different. So it really is a trial and error period with their jeans. But when you find the right ones, I'm telling you, they are fantastic. It's just the journey to doing that can be a little bit more cumbersome, but I really do love these jeans. They fit really good, they look really good, and I'm, I'm happy that I have them. So now it is time for the dress portion of today's video. You know I gotta have one in every single video, and, and this one is gonna be no exception. So the first dress that I'm gonna be sharing with y'all today is going to be a denim style dress, and I thought this was so, so cute on the model. Not really sure how I feel about it on myself, but you know, it just is what it is. But this is what it looks like. So this is a deep V-neck denim dress and it has some really cool details that I really enjoy, including this little like wrap detail that goes onto the back. So, so cute, but I have to say that I really love the elastic hem sleeves. It almost kind of creates like an 80s bubble sleeve in a way. <sighs> I mean, it just knew what it took to get to my heart. <laughs> so, but one thing I will say about this dress is it is very plungy. It is just, you know, boobalicious for sure. Particularly for Old Navy, like I am not used to them being so cleavagey. They're usually a little bit more modest, but not this one, honey, not this one. <laughs> so also I wanna mention that the denim fabric is a little bit thinner than what I was expecting. So, and I do understand the whole method behind it because it gives it a lot of flow and allows for a lot of movement. So, I mean, they definitely achieved that for sure. But I picked this dress up in a size 2X tall, really for a couple of reasons. One, because they didn't have my size in the regular version. And two, I have been really enjoying the whole like maxi length denim trend lately. I think it is very becoming, it's very cute. And not to mention that the maxi style length almost creates like an optical illusion to make you look long and lean and thinner. And you know, we love a good optical illusion here. <laughs> so if y'all enjoy an all black outfit, then this next one is gonna be right up your alley. So this is gonna be a two piecer again. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna have a top and we're gonna have some bottoms. And the top is one that I don't really know how I feel about. It looks really pretty on, it feels really good on, but the static cling here is real. <laughs> it makes my hair stand up and it like clings to my body like nobody's business, but this is what the top looks like. So I picked this one up in a size 2X and it's like that satiny material. And this one comes in a buttload of colors. So if you don't like black, you can definitely pick it up in like beigey, creamy colors, grays, and those types of things, really nice neutrals but it's this really nice like long sleeve, very, very soft satin. It has functional buttons going down the front of this blouse as well as functional buttons right there at the wrist. So if you wanna roll it up for a little bit more of a casual look, you can totally do that. And one thing I wanna mention about this is I find that the material is a little bit on the sheer side, like it's not the end of the world. You're not gonna be able to see all your goods underneath it, but it's just something that I wanted to mention because if you did pick this up, you might be like, oh, it's, it's kind of a little bit sheer. But the pants, y'all, the pants, is where it's at when I was building this outfit. Like these pants feel so, so nice. They are a linen mixture. So they're made of like 55% linen and 45% rayon. So not only are they breathable, but they're airy, they're lightweight. They kind of like move whenever you're walking and they create that like difference in texture. So you have the satin from the top and you have the linen from the bottom that just makes it look really expensive. Like it just kind of plays with the eye and it just looks really, really good on. I love these. 
so much and I think I'm gonna go back for another pair. So this is what they look like. They have an elastic back end and I picked these up in a size 2X. They have pockets, they also have belt loops. So if you do wanna wear these to work, you can pair it with a belt and you are good to go. Right there at the waist, they do have a double hook and bar closure. I think that's what it's called when it comes to trousers. I'm not really sure, but it also has a hidden button closure as well. So they got it going on with these pants. Like they're making sure that you don't fall out. Nobody's spilling out of these suckers anytime soon, but they do feel really nice and expensive and just really good quality. They also have functional side pockets as well as one singular trouser pocket in the back, which I'm not really sure why they did that whole thing, but I have a question for y'all. So my daughter is actually graduating college in a couple of weeks and I was thinking about this outfit being like my go to the graduation outfit. I would love to know y'all's thoughts and opinions. Like it's kind of a big deal. She's gonna be the first person to ever graduate college in my whole family. And I, I just wanna wear like the right thing. And I don't know if black on black is appropriate. We're also gonna be meeting her boyfriend's parents that day. He's also graduating that day. And it's, it's getting kind of serious. So we're seeing like a future here. <laughs> so let me know if you think this outfit is appropriate or if you have like experiences with going to college graduations. Is black on black okay? I would love to know. Like, I guess I can Google it, but I, I would trust y'all's opinions a whole lot more. And really and truly y'all, like a black on black outfit is something that you just cannot go wrong with. It's just sophisticated without even trying. It's very slimming, it's very becoming, it's very luxurious because of the multitude of textures and I can't get enough. All right, y'all, so the final outfit in today's video is not gonna be an outfit at all. In fact, it's going to be a bathing suit. And this is a bathing suit that I myself was influenced to buy by none other than the Glitter and Lasers here on YouTube. In fact, I follow her on Instagram and the woman is perpetually on vacation. Has anybody ever noticed that? <laughs> it's like she's always at the beach and she's always in like a different swimsuit, a different bikini and I, I fell in love with this swimsuit so much that I almost bought it twice. <laughs> this is what the bathing suit looks like. And this is from Old Navy, which I had no idea, but whenever I followed her links, like the rabbit hole links, it brought me to Old Navy and I was like, you know what? I'm going to add it to my already like <laughs> festering pile of clothes that I bought. So anyway, this is what the bottoms look like. And I love this really cool, like minty, striper, it's like a candy striper piece. If mint julep was a bathing suit, then this would be it y'all. So it's like so lively and refreshing. Although I don't really know if it's meant for my body type. I'm just not really sure there. So we have the high-waisted full backside bottoms and then the asymmetrical top. Super duper cute y'all, but I have to tell you <laughs> that I was a little bit worried that these wouldn't have like the built-in breast pads. You just don't know whenever you're buying from a brand that you're unfamiliar with. And I don't think I've ever bought a bathing suit from Old Navy in my whole entire life at least for an adult. I bought some for kids, but never for an adult. But I have to tell you that it does have breast pads that come with it. And the material is nice and really thick. So you're not gonna have any see-through moments. Thank the Lord. But I picked the top up in a size extra large. I picked the bottoms up in a size double X and the bottoms fit fine. I have no problems with them. The top, I'm not really sure about. And my method behind buying this size was the fact that I have such heavy, dense breasts that I didn't want like a whole South Park situation with them just flopping down, <laughs> you know, like underneath the swimsuit. So I figured like compression was best, but I don't know. I would love to know y'all's thoughts and opinions down in the comment section down below. All right, y'all, that is gonna do it for this Old Navy plus size Tron haul video. I hope y'all found this video helpful and enjoyable and informative and all the good things. <laughs> if you did, please consider liking and subscribing. I would greatly appreciate it. And as always, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I always appreciate each and every one of you. Please stay safe and stay healthy in this weird, crazy, wicked world that we're living in. And I'll be seeing y'all very, very soon. Bye.